here with head coach Mike Roislin after a loss to the U Mary Marauders. And it was senior day, Mike, and I just want you to touch on a little bit the three seniors and the impact that they've had on uh, on their career here at the Minnesota, here at the University of Minnesota Crookston. Well, I, I can't say enough about all three of them. I mean, uh, Maria has been here the, the last two years, and she was a great addition. And obviously, Caitlin and EC have been here. Caitlin's been here four, EC's been here five. And, uh, you know, they're great ambassadors, not only for our program, but our university. They, they get it done in the classroom. I mean, obviously, both EC and Caitlin have uh, have had great careers on the on the hardwood, and, and I can't thank them, them enough for the effort that they've put in and, and the extra time and different things along that. You, it's really hard to lose people you get attached mm-hmm. to and that have been here such, such a long period of time and I, I think Maria fits right into that mold and mm-hmm. we're going to, she wants to go on this coaching field, we're going to try to do everything we can to help her out as, as she moves forward and, um, but it's a, you know, it's, a, it's, 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 it's really kind of bittersweet because mm-hmm. you're so happy for them and all their accomplishments but yet, yet you hate to see them go but uh, you're happy that, that I know that they're going to be very successful individuals as they move on to whatever careers that they, that they choose in the future here. Well, Mike, a little bit different. Last time we played the Marauders, a lot better defensively. What would you guys change in uh, in today's game that you maybe didn't do last time in Bismarck? Well, I think that we just, you know, we defended mm-hmm. better. I mean, I think the big thing for us is that, uh, you know, we're just we're just too inconsistent. Sometimes we get the stops and then we don't get the scores or. Uh, what's happening with us? We get great big play one night and mm-hmm. from and scoring production, and then, and then our guards uh, don't, uh, you know, play as well as or, or finish as well as we'd like them to do. And then some nights it's the guards that are keeping us in the game, and our bigs are struggling a little bit. So we just got to try to find a way to stay the course and try to try to keep improving. We are improving. Mm-hmm. I mean, uh, we got a lot of people sitting on the bench right now, and uh, but we got a lot of we've got a lot of new faces out there playing, and they're getting better as we're going here. So we got one week to try to to try to to get better to see what we can do on Friday and Saturday and then prepare ourselves for, for that following Wednesday. Well, Mike, it doesn't really seem possible. Well, last weekend of the last weekend of the regular season, next week on the road in Duluth and uh, St. Cloud, what's it going to take to end this losing streak and hopefully get a sweep next weekend? Well, we just, we just it's the word consistency. Mm-hmm. We've got to get it on both ends. Like one night the offense is there and the defense is, and mm-hmm. one night the defense is there and we don't have enough from the offense. So we got to find a way to try to get, try to blend it in together so we get it on both sides and then it'll give us a better chance. All right, thanks, Mike. Thank you.